today we are going to discuss how to prove the Pythagoras theorem. As you know, Pythagoras theorem is used for right triangles only. Now we are given that there is a triangle ABC in which angle B is 90 degrees, and we have to prove that hypotenuse square, which is AC, that is AC square, is equal to perpendicular square plus base square. So what is the perpendicular? AB is the perpendicular and BC is the base. So we have to prove that AC square is equal to AB square plus BC square. So how do we start? First of all, we draw BD perpendicular to AC. Okay, we draw a line from B that meets AC at point D such that it is perpendicular to AC. Now, let's see how these triangles are similar and why we have drawn these triangles. Now, as you can see, this is triangle ABC, our initial triangle. And if I we can have two triangles from this after we draw the perpendicular. One of the triangles is A, B, D. Okay. And now what I do is I will simply flip this A, D, B and keep it over here. Now watch these two triangles. Angle A is the same, isn't it? And angle B is 90 degree, angle D is 90 degree. You can easily see that these two triangles are similar. Even if I keep this triangle here, you can see it differs only in size, but it is similar to this triangle. Even if I keep my original triangle, you can see these triangles are very very similar. So, because they have the angle angle similarity. Angle A which is the same and angle B is 90 degree, angle D is 90 degree. So, and automatically angle C will be equal to angle D. And if you don't know why, please remember to ask me again. You have covered this and you know some of the, I, I will give you a hint. Some of all the three triangle, some of all the three angles is 180 degree. And now we come to our second triangle. Now this is our second triangle B, D, C. Now if I flip this over, this is like this. I flipped it over, this is like this B, D, C. Once again you can say this you can easily see these two are similar why because angle b is 90 degrees and angle d is also 90 degrees and angle c is the same in both the triangles so these two are also similar triangles you can easily see these two are similar isn't it they differ only in size, but they are very similar. They are very similar. See how the sides match as I shift them. How the angles match. Now, we so we have proved that triangle ABC is similar to triangle ADD as well as to triangle B, D, C. So, what happens in similar triangles? In similar triangles, corresponding sides are in a proportionate ratio. Corresponding sides have a ratio that is equal to each other. So, when we consider triangle A, B, C and triangle a, D, B. A, B 
डिवाइडेड बाय एडी कॉरेस्पोंडिंग साइड्स इज इक्वल टू बीसी डिवाइडेड बाय डीबी कॉरेस्पोंडिंग साइड्स इज इक्वल टू एसी डिवाइडेड बाय एबी कॉरेस्पोंडिंग साइड्स therefore now we consider ab by ad and ac by ab because we need to prove ac square is equal to ab square plus bc square and we need to find the value of ab square therefore when we consider these two and cross multiply ab square is equal to ad into ac this is Our equation number one. Similarly, when we consider triangle ABC and triangle BDC, then AB divided by BD corresponding sides is equal to BC divided by DC corresponding sides is equal to AC divided by BC. Corresponding sides. Out of these, we consider these two to find the value of BC square, which is BC square is equal to DC into AC, which is our second equation. Now we simply add equations one and two. So the left hand sides of these two equations are added: AB square plus BC square, and then the right hand side of these equations are added. Is equal to AB square plus BC square is equal to AC into AD plus AC into DC. Taking out AC as the common factor, we have AC into AD plus DC. But what is AD plus DC? AD plus DC is AC. So we have AB square plus BC square is equal to AC into AC. AC into AC is simply AC squared. So AB square plus BC square is equal to AC squared, and this is exactly what we need to prove. So this is how we can prove our Pythagoras theorem. Thank you. We really hope that you liked our video as well as gained some useful info. We will continually post more and more interesting and informative videos in the upcoming future. So, please share our videos as much as possible. Hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to press the bell icon.